When you park your car at Pearson Airport before heading off on a trip, you would think that it would be safe. But that wasn't the case for dozens in recent months, including a City News viewer and airport employee. Well, let's go look at the color. You just go like this. It's 3 o'clock in the morning. There's nobody around. And they just walk around. And if they, if they want to be a little careful, they can just go and chalk the car. Ted Krofchak has been working at Pearson Airport for 19 years. This past May, his truck was stolen. Uh, I had a lot of uh, vested emotional and uh, financial interest in the truck. I had maintained the truck uh, to a very high standard for myself. It was a 2006 truck, but it was in mint condition. So I, I looked at the whole experience as just incredibly wasteful, where somebody took the vehicle and just took all the parts off of it and just threw it out into a field. So I thought, okay, maybe I was unlucky. So I started uh, asking questions with the police, and then I started discovering that I was not just the only unlucky person. According to this Peel Regional Police report, from February to May, 40 vehicles were stolen from airport parking lots. You think thieves are targeting parking lots here at the airport? Generally, it's because of the type of employees that are working here. They're, uh, they, they must commute to work. Once they do come here, they're leaving their vehicles here for days on end. So the professional thieves, I'm, we can call them, know that these vehicles are parked here for day upon day. So I've been told by the police that they're even chalking, the thieves are chalking vehicles to keep track of them in the parking lot. So they just come back a day later, they know the truck or car has been there, and they come and steal it the next night. The Greater Toronto Airports Authority responded with this statement. We take this matter very seriously and are actively increasing our security and monitoring detail through greater police presence and surveillance at our parking facilities, increased security patrols, increased camera coverage and monitoring of all employee and public spaces, and greater security presence at entry and exit points. The problem. Across Toronto, there have nearly been 2,700 auto thefts this year. That's already a 32% increase from all of last year, and the ratio of cases cleared or solved is very small, between 11 and 15%. Ted wants to see change starting with his workplace. I pay $120 a month. There are 6,600 employee parking spaces here that are being sold. There's $750,000 worth of money that the GTAA is collecting from employees only. And they could put a fence up. Perfect. Now, Ted says he still hasn't heard back from the GTAA, but he plans on taking them to a small claims court. We did reach out to Peel Regional Police, and they say that they're currently investigating these auto thefts with uh, the GTAA. And this story was brought to us by a City News viewer. And if you have a story that you would like for us to share, here are all the ways that you can get in touch with us.